Hey guys, Joey here with Joe's RV Tech DIY. Today we're changing out a uh, ice maker on a Dometic refrigerator and uh, just show you guys how simple it is. So first step I like to do is take the screws out of the top. In this specific one there's four. Two on the top, two on the bottom. Ice makers go bad on refrigerators once in a blue moon. They usually last pretty long. But some of these are pretty easy DIY to do. And in my opinion, this is one of them. Now we're going to take off these lower screws. I'm just using manual screw driver so you guys don't have to listen to the drill. But Honestly, I don't like using power tools on the refrigerators, especially when reinstalling it. These screws here are kind of long, as you can see. One more. The whole thing should start to move a little. Take the screw out. As you guys can see, there's a plug harness right here. And in order to unplug this, you have to pull, lift up a little bit. I don't know if you guys can see me doing that in the video. Lift up on that, and then just pull. So, and it's completely detached from the fridge at this point. And we can remove the ice maker. Grab our new one, put it in here, hook up the harness, and you may have to reuse part of the harness, like on this one, so I don't show you that step, but um, make sure that when you go back up, you line it up to the holes, and I like to put the top screws back on first. And before you line it up, you see this tube right here that's coming through the wall? That's where the water comes and fills up this tray so it can freeze and give you ice. So we're going to go ahead and put the top screw back on here. We're doing this in real time. This video is not edited. So you guys will get an idea of how long this should take you. Um, if it's your first time, it's probably going to take you a little bit longer. Sorry about that. I bumped the camera. We want to make sure it's as level as possible. The other screw in. So now we got two in place. And it should kind of hold itself. The screws in the bottom are already lined up. We'll put one more in here. And it's done. And that, my friends, is how fast it takes me to install an ice maker on a side-by-side -side Dometic refrigerator. Uh, model number on this one is a... RM 1350 MMSSX. So, um, as you can see, it wasn't too difficult of a job. I think it took me like three minutes and some change here. But this is something you could do yourself. Realistically, all you need is a Phillips screwdriver. And uh, make sure you order the right ice maker. I'll post a link below where you can get some of these ice makers in case you guys are interested. So, until next time, thanks for watching Joe's RV Tech DIY. Be sure to subscribe, and thanks for watching, and safe travels out there, guys.